All right, guys, let's talk about a big old rumor that should interest fans of the Fantastic Four and specifically the MCU version that's coming at us. This rumor is suggesting that the one and only Brad Bird is in the running to direct the upcoming film. Yeah, that would be pretty incredible. Yeah, I admit it. That was, a, that was a bad opening. I admit that. But hey, Brad Bird, in case you don't know who he is, you've probably seen his films. You've probably seen The Incredibles and The Incredibles 2. You've probably seen Ratatouille. You might not have seen Tomorrowland. Yeah, I actually like Tomorrowland. I thought it was pretty decent, but a lot of people didn't see it, and the marketing was kind of misleading on what that film was. But ultimately, I ended up enjoying the film. And Brad Bird has actually, I, I would say he's delivered the best Fantastic Four film so far with The Incredibles. Like, is anybody actually going to argue that? So when it comes to his name being rumored for Fantastic Four, I think he would be an obvious choice. He's almost so obvious of a choice that it sounds too good to be true. Now, naturally, you know, I don't know if Disney would want to go that way or if Kevin Feige would want to go that way, but Brad Bird knows how to direct. And if you're going to get somebody that's going to direct something that involves a family, specifically the Fantastic Four, Brad Bird is the obvious choice. Like, all you have to do is figure out how to take the incredible script, turn him into Fantastic Four, even more and then just put it into live action and it would work tremendously and certainly one of the best parts of the Incredibles of both films I would say is the family interaction is how they interact with one another it's how they handle real life situations and how the family can work together and against a villain certainly something that the first family of comics really needs so i really hope this one is true like this is something that i really hope happens i think brad bird you know after tomorrowland really deserves another big shot and i think this would be it it's marvel studios he knows how to handle that type of dynamic for the family it's too perfect like i said but hopefully it's the one like if it's not peyton reed i have no problem with brad bird doing it he would honestly be perfect